Let me start by saying how much I love Splatoon's update cycle. With all the new weapons being released at once at the start of new season, it's so much fun. I know it's not perfect, and nothing ever is, but it's still enjoyable. The cycle could maybe use a few extra mid-season mid -season balance patches or something to freshen up the gameplay, but it'll, all in all, it's not necessary. Why do I love it so much? Well, with all the weapons being released at once, it creates a fresh feeling in the game, and if you're coming back to the game at the start of a new season, then the gameplay will feel completely different, because all of the new weapons you want to try out all the new weapons and it will be a long time before you get a board again and also with all the new weapons coming out at the same time everyone will be so excited to use them meaning you'll get into the matches with some unique time comps that would, that would seem weird any other time but because it's the start of the new season with people using all the new weapons it just seems normal like at the start of season season where else would you come across a match with blasters and paintbrushes it definitely mixes up the gameplay from normal and any other time you play the game you will not have the same experience and as this go as the time goes on the new weapon kits and new weapons phase out or some become staples and you get the idea of how they fit into the meta and then about two or three weeks later the new normal has been reached and the gameplay has changed up again and enough for you you to see how the new weapons actually fit into standard teams. As fun as this is, I of course I have to mention the other side of the argument, the downside to this, which with all the unusual team comes and people only using the new weapons, it's not a fair representation of how they would actually fit in the game, and if they were too powerful or too weak, the developers would not know until a few weeks later when the metal has actually settled down for a bit. There is also the fact that you have a burst of new energy when the new season launches and another burst when the meta settles down and the gameplay changes up again and then there is a long long dead time when there's nothing really happening and the game just gets stale. But I don't think this is necessarily a bad thing, it gets an idea of where weapons are good or not and in a constant meta for people that are actually dedicated to playing the game. And there's the fact that the staleness giving you a low point makes the high even better when the freshening up of the new season comes. Of course, I have to mention the alternative, which would just be to release one new weapon periodically, like every two weeks or so. The idea behind that it keeps the gameplay fresh and there's something new always coming out to keep players coming back. When this sounds like a good idea, will just end up being a day of two of everyone using the new weapons which will get very boring very quickly and then mostly then mostly go back to normal. Players may hate the time of a new weapon coming out being repeatedly splattered by the same weapon and avoid altogether, meaning they will stop they might they're more likely to stop permanently playing the game. And I feel like it it'll be a repetitive cycle of a new weapon coming out and the gameplay won't be freshened up like with loads of new weapon kits coming out instead it, instead it will go stale and there's also the fact that games that have done this in the past and went this route like clash royale eventually the developers end up running out of ideas or motivation for new things to come out and it's stressful with the strict deadlines to work to to release a new thing so they might end up missing something or the quality of the weapons drop and end up not sticking to schedule and will end up getting nothing in updates so they're the pros and cons of both sides i like the chaos of a new season with all the new maps and all the new weapons but what do you think which side would you be on let me know or if you have a unique idea of how updates could go let me know in the comments until next time see ya